This particular drawing has been converted from an AutoCAD DWG file and it's very much larger than a corresponding drawing in the GCAD plus native environment. And I'm trying to work out why that's the case. If I select a block such as this, I can see that it consists of three individual blocks. What I'll now do is edit that block and just click in here and see what's happened. So in, this is very inefficient drafting because instead of there being one block and then stamped three times, we've got uh, lots of individual elements. I'll close the block editor and what I will do is just use uh, the point command. So I'll draw uh, a point at the center of each of those blocks. That will help me in a moment when I make a block. So I've got a, a marker point where I want them and I'll right click and exit. Now if I dive in here and say edit the block, what I now want to do is to eliminate most of this drawing, most of this block drawing. And all I'm doing is grabbing as many entities as I can which are superfluous to the block. And that one needs to go, that one can go, and that one can go. That'll do for the moment. Here's the base point of the block. So what I'm going to do is to move. I'll select all of those, and I'll move those from there to the base point. That will mean when this new block comes in, it will be anchored at that point. And I'll erase those. So now when we close the block editor, we've only got one symbol. And you remember, I'll move it out of the way, you remember I put a point at the center of each instance of it. So I can say copy what's now just one symbol from there to there to there and hit escape and I can eliminate that one. So now we have exactly the same result, but we've reduced the file size of the drawing. Now I suspect that's going to be the case for all of these blocks. Let's look at this next one. Yeah, that's a group of three as well. So as one looks at, as zooms out of it and looks at this drawing, I think you may well be able to see that most of the symbols in there are groups of three, four, five, and six. That means this drawing is three, four, or five, or even six times bigger than it needs to be. And it's going to necessarily be a little slower to manipulate. So be wary of drawings that come from the AutoCAD environment. They may well have been made in a very inefficient fashion.